Well, we are out here enjoying the cooler temperatures, although summer is on the way, and what a great way to get outdoors. I'm here with Alan Prather, the biodiversity scientist with Michigan State University's Beale Botanical Garden for today's Mid Michigan Matters. And whoa, a little windy here. We got this <laughs> flying up. But when it's nicer out, people like to enjoy the um, summer months, the outdoors, and really immerse themselves in nature. What is the benefit of being with the plants? Well, I like to say in simple terms, just being outside makes you a better person. But of course, the reason why it does, and we know this from science, that just being outside changes your physiology, it relaxes you, it makes you more creative, it, it does all sorts of things for you. So my advice is just get outside as often as you can. Oh, and I do not blame you. I love being outdoors, except with all this wind. But we have some of these lovely plants right behind us. And so when people are planting and gardening this season, um, what are some of the plants really known and native to Michigan? So some of the things I love, actually we have a couple right here. Red columbine is one of my favorite oh. plants, a Michigan native, and Virginia bluebells is oh, another one. Beautiful, I wish you guys could see it, yeah. but that means you have to come outside in order to see these. Some right. sustainable practices to really make sure that you've got your green thumb and you're growing these plants beautifully. Mm -hmm. So mostly I think the idea is that if you plant native plants, you're gonna need less fertilizer, less water oh. because they're well adapted for our environment. So native plants is, if you wanna be sustainable, that's the most important thing you can do. All right, that is really good to know. And um, if people wanna keep knowing and learning about plants and being out in nature, there are a few events that they can attend and one of them a huge celebration for Beale Botanical Garden, 150 years. That's right, we were 150 years old this year. We were established on the campus of Michigan State University, 1873 by William James Beale. So we're happy to be celebrating that. Um, we have a couple of events coming up that are important. Be sure to write, check out our website for more details on these and some, some events happening more quickly. But on June 10th, we're launching a well-being program, which is, uh, a program that is designed by MSU students and faculty to teach you how to enjoy nature and become more present in the moment. There's a number of exercises you can perform with that. So come out for our launch party on the first, I'm oh, sorry, June 10th, <laughs> um, June 20th. And then on the 25th is the very first Music in the Garden this year. And the Spartan Jazz Quartet will be performing with us from the College of Music on campus, so student musicians. And around that we'll have, um, at both ends, some gardening stuff. So look for a history tour and other events like that. Awesome. Well, hey, Alan, congratulations to 150 years with Beale Botanical Garden. We'll have to come check it out. You will see me around there for sure. But in speaking of uh, planting your plants and making sure that they're okay with all of this hot, dry weather, let's